Hey y'all, I'm back at Freedom Homes in Alexandria, Alabama, and I've got another sunshine home. Uh, this is the, can't remember the name, but uh, I've got it in there, I've got the floor plan. Um, at Freedom Homes, they're calling it the Freedom 76. So, nice single wide, got the electric fireplace, Got a nice tile shower in it. Very nice looking home inside. Got your exterior spigot. You're gonna have two two electrical outlets. You got one by this back door, and then you got one by the front door. But kind of tied in here so I'm gonna go back around we'll go in the front but if you like this home or my channel just uh, please give me a like share comment subscribe I've got a goal of trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of July so Help me out, folks. Help me reach my goal. All right, let's come in. You come in and right off as you come in, you got this electric fireplace with the mantle. Got everything set up for your TV. Now some people don't want their TV above the fireplace, but you can always option to put it somewhere else or option to get a different home. But a lot of people, they want it there, they like it. So, yes, everybody does get what they want with it. And that's the great thing about these manufactured homes, just like the stick belt homes, there's always something that you can find that you can like yourself. You got your pen a uh, got your pendant lights above the bar or your island. Got an outlet in the island. I love the countertop. I love the butcher block on there. And you do have your sink in the island but right across from your sink you got your windows where you can look out enjoy the view but first let's come over here you got your well this is the freedom 76 as they've got it three bedroom two bath 1185 square foot uh, 89,900 and it's energy efficient OSB house wrap low E thermopane windows stainless steel appliances soft closed cabinets and drawers 2x4 exterior walls and 2x6 floor joists and the, the price includes delivery and setup heat pump installation steps and vinyl skirting and a five-year warranty and this is the arc 1680 800 and here's the floor plan um, it's a 16 by 80 three bed two bath your master bedroom is going to be 12 4 by 15 foot then you've got um, Kitchen area 11 1 by the 15, and then 13 5 by 15 in the living room, 9 foot by probably 8 foot. So you got another small bedroom, and but this does have the wood shelves in the closet, and then the, the other is 9 foot by 15. So and then um, this option is going to be the one with just the tile shower, but you can option in a tub and shower. 
that you lose part of your vanity. But when I was noticing on the thing, you can always uh, pause it on this, but here's some of the standard features with the with this home. So before I go on with the tour, I want to remind everyone that I do have I do write books. I'm an author. Um, I write westerns. Uh, the names of the westerns are, they all start with Trail of Adventure, but it's Trail of Fire, Trail of Dead Men, and Trail of the Condemned. So if you like westerns or know anybody that does, you can pick them up on Amazon, um, uh, Barnes and Noble, uh, different ones, and um, just check around. You can put in uh, M.T. Deason books and it'll come up. But let's go on with the tour. I love the cabinets and the cabinets do all go to the ceiling. And you got lots of cabinets in here. And you got the drawers over doors. And red it is. These are soft clothes, and you've got adjustable shelves in there. You've got a built-in microwave. And this is the Beko appliances but very nice kitchen I love this door I know some don't like the country barn door I love the country life so I love this stuff but go in here got your whole house cut off you got your washer hookups got your dryer vent i like having the little alcove put it in you've got your water heater right there you've got shelves right here that you can either use as a pantry or as you know, for your laundry detergents well that didn't work uh got your breaker box right there and your back door so a nice little laundry area pantry area let's go back towards this other area look at the spare bedrooms and as i usually say i would turn this one into an office I kind of make these things small now you Pro you could fit a full-size bed in it, but you might have room for a dresser or a chest of drawers, but definitely not both. Be more for a, ch for a twin bed for a child, or like I said, for an office, be great. Like I said you got the wood shelves in the closets. And it says the regular kind of small closets for the single wides and you've got the single piece uh, shower and tub combo got they don't have the mirrors up but you got the lighting right there besides the main light You got the butcher block counters in here. You got your shelves now, or got your cabinet down there for storage. And then this room, you can tell it's bigger or a lot longer with it. It's got 
same size closet with the wood shelves. You got your single window in here. All right, let's head to the master bedroom. Or master suite. Right there's your where your air handler would be. And you got two windows in here giving you plenty of light. And this is eight foot ceilings if in the home and your vents are gonna be on the floor. Coming into the master bath, where I would forgot on a couple of videos. Uh, here's your vanity in here. I like it, nice big vanity. Got the lights above it. Got the butcher block counters. Got a single drawer on this one, but then you got several cabinets on bottom. Over here, you've got your commode. You've got a window, can't see through, so you got your privacy, but it does open. And then you've got this nice tile shower, rain head, rain, rain head, um, whatever you call it my mind's going blank getting old then you've got your regular uh, shower head that's what i'm trying to think so you got your dual controls for it so whichever shower you want and then as the sunshine homes have this rock bottom in there very nice shower. Love this. Then come over here. You got a nice size closet with the wood shelves. You got a built in right here with these shelves. And then your clothes racks. You could even put a second thing of below it you got your can lighting inside so very nice home really really pretty home so if you like this my content on my channel give me a like share comment subscribe and also remember my books um love for you to order them i'm trying to get them redone right now and uh, get a major publishing company or traditional publishing company to take it on but here's more information about this home if you like it there's your price so Hope y'all all have a great day. Take care. God bless you. Stay free. And, and stay away. Y'all take care. See you on the next one. Bye for now.